I just got here to work and bro, I'm really tired. My body is dead. My body, my eyes, my, oh my God, how am I gonna get through today? I just ate lunch and today I did not bring my book. How did I forget to bring my backpack? It's upsetting. So I'm just gonna take a nap. My glasses won't record. Memory's probably full, but I just finished my eight bottle for the day. Gallon already done before the end of the day. Just clocked out. Now it's time to go home work on my channels probably not work out but i do want to go and try to play basketball today it's 4 30 now it's time to go on the run running after work is so painful bro guess what <laughs> both of the courts are taken All right, so right now the video is exporting. It is at the moment 10.19. I'm gonna journal, hopefully finish journaling by 10.30 so that then I can learn for an hour from 10.30 to 11.30 and then knock out. All right, boys, we just uploaded the video. Well, it's uploading right now. It is 10.42. We have done majority of the non-negotiables. Let's actually pull it up here. Majority of the non-negotiables, I just did not read. I already journaled for the day. All I really need to do left is learn for one hour. I know, I should have read. I did not read during lunch because I did not take my book. I forgot my backpack here at home and that is my mistake. Pomodoro to an hour and hop on the real world because we got to do this we should be done by 11 45 sleeping at 12 nothing new <laughs> but at least we're doing something productive with our time actually let's not start it yet let's go ahead and go into the course we left off at the flipping also known as brokey course which teaches us how to make money turning trash to cash escaping brokeyville is a module and there are seven lessons in this module first a hundred dollar steps the flipping simple steps is your direct path from no money to your first hundred dollars flipping. You can repeat as much as you want. One complete flipping course. Step two. Go to preferred marketplace is step two. Step three, find items. You will use the course as your guide. You must find items for free or cheap as shown inside of the training modules. If you have no items, you won't make money money is made through exchanging something somebody values for something you value aka money step four list items the only way people will know about your items is by you listing them stop expecting to magically make money doing nothing we live in a physical world for every action there is always a reaction you will make money guaranteed as thousands of other students of mine have when you follow my instructions and list your items meaning take two to three good pictures of the item that you've gotten for free or for cheap you can even find items in your own house that you don't use anymore to list and sell obviously you need your parents permission however i am waking your minds up to the possibilities that will make you rich right now there are items around you that you don't even use which you could sell and make money with i accept zero excuses from you step five profit the way flipping works is you charge more for something than you paid meaning you got an item for five dollars and you see other people selling the summer item for twenty dollars you sell your item for fifteen dollars giving you a ten dollar profit when somebody comes to buy a used item they are looking to get it cheaper than they would pay for it if it was brand new your items are good quality but because they're used you don't charge full price so make sure to see what other people are selling items for sell yours for less but charge more than you paid to acquire that item you can also get a lot of items for free meaning you profit regardless of how much you charge you are now making money the universe operates on math 
Flipping is a numbers game. The more you sell, the more money you make. Once you make $5, then you repeat it, you have $10. Obviously, you can sell items for much more than this. I'm simply waking your mind up to your new reality. I want to be updated daily on the actions that you were taking from the $100 steps. So the last video, he was basically saying everything that I already read. But we have now finished the flipping brokey course. We are actually going to put some action into what we just learned. We are not going to go into the neighborhood side hustles. Right now we want to focus on the flipping brokey course because it wouldn't make sense for me to watch this course and then go straight into the other side hustles and not try a side hustle, just learn about them. So we're going to be focusing on flipping these next couple of days, which is going to be exciting because if you guys have been watching the videos, you guys may know that I've been reselling Pokemon cards and retro games. So that is kind of something I've already been trying to put into practice, but there are a couple things that I've seen in the real world that I didn't know about already. And I'm excited to, I guess, track my progress because usually when I sell something, I don't really keep track of it. Or I don't put it aside into its own, you know account and this time whatever i make from flipping will continue to be reinvested into flipping for more items i'm excited to start putting this into effect if you guys didn't know i have so many pokemon cards and retro games that need to be even listed on ebay and offer up today we even got a notification from ebay selling that we sold one of the retro games for ten dollars so tomorrow we're gonna ship that out thank god we don't need a shipping label printer for that but we do need to get a new shipping label printer for the pokemon cards as well as the clothing brand so that's gonna be an investment that we're gonna have to make most likely tomorrow or when we get paid honestly so far I have nothing bad to say about the real world. Obviously, some things are repeated, but there are some little tips and some little things that I haven't seen on YouTube and I didn't know about. So far, it's still worth it. With the money from flipping, we are going to continue to reinvest it into buying more things to flip and resell. I do have a notion page on how much I spent on the games and how much I'm selling them for or plan on selling them for and even the Pokemon cards. I have a bunch of Pokemon cards that need to be listed. Those are ones that I didn't expect to start selling, but I've sold a couple now and I can't even imagine how much I can make from selling Pokemon cards. At least I hope. I hope so. You never know. You never know with this reselling stuff. Sometimes things are in demand, sometimes things sell, and sometimes they don't. Who cares? We, we just try to make a quick buck, even if it's five bucks, ten bucks. They, it just starts adding up. An hour of learning from the real world is done. Tomorrow, we're going to start a different, I guess, course or different campus in the real world since we just finished one and we're going to put in effort into putting action into one. We don't want to start another side hustle, but we do want to continue learning. We'll start we'll start off this challenge with a hundred. Trying to go from zero dollars to a hundred dollars from reselling and flipping things. Then we'll go from a hundred to five hundred, five hundred to a thousand and just keep going up from there. <laughs> but I'll catch you guys in the next video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you guys are enjoying the content. I'll see you guys tomorrow. It is 12.15 and I just realized that I got billed for Notion, Adobe, and 24 hours. I got charged for 24 hour fitness because there's an annual fee on top of what I already paid. Like what the hell? But it is what it is. Leaving us at $546 in my bank account.